Day one of the 2023 Northwest District Boys Singles and Doubles play from Division One and Two at the home of the Redskins. Today we saw the opening rounds of singles and doubles action from Division Two. Let's start on Court Eight, where Elida senior Dylan Byers is taking on Vermilion sophomore Severin Kretschmar. Byers gets a nice over the net here for the point as Kretschmar can't handle it. However, the Bulldog would fall in the end by a score of 6-0, 6-1 in two sets. Now over at court six, another Bulldog in action. This time it's Ada senior Brendan Jamison starting his day off against Huron sophomore Mason Schnidley. And he gets the overhand slam too much for Schnidley as Jamison gets the point. However, Jamison would go on to lose in two sets, 6-1, 6-3. We move right next door to court five, where St. Mary's junior Isaac Wibbler face off against St. Mary's CC's Will Cundiff, and the Rough Rider makes easy work of this match as he gets the point on the soft touch volley, 3-6, 6-3, 6-3, the final in three sets. And in the second round, Wibbler can't get it going with Sabbath Vindrendra from Ottawa Hills, and he is eliminated in two sets. Finally, next to him was the other Rough Rider competing, Cody Burt on court four, taking on Perkins sophomore Chase Young, in the first round, and his game is strong, beating Young with a huge overhand slam to get the point. However, Burt would fall in the first round, and he's, he loses 7-6, 6-1. Let's head to doubles action in the opening round as Elida sophomores Jaden Newman and Ben Osmond go the distance with Ontario on court six. Newman gets the ace for the point, and the Bulldogs advance with a score of 6-3, 4-6, 6-2. -6 However, in the second round, Elida couldn't match the energy from the seniors from Ottawa Hills, so they are eliminated in the second round. Over on court four, Titan seniors Theo Mag and Levi Unterbrink leave it all on the court today for Ottawa Glandorf. But at the end of the match, the OG duo come up short, losing by a score of 6 0 6 1. And finally, on court two, the Dolan brothers from Bath take care of Upper Sandusky as a backhand from Ezra splits the opponents. And the Wildcats advance with a score of 6 3 6 2. In the second round, they play in the court right next to their rivals, Elida, in their second round match as the Bath brothers get it done against Archbold. Daniel and Ezra will be back here for finals on Saturday at 10 a.m.